The internet is saying that this Asian girl we see on the screens right now is faking her accent. Is she though? Yes, I have an accent because I ain't from here. I was born in Thailand and I grew up in Georgia for a decade. And then I fucking moved to Nebraska. Hello guys, welcome back. And if you don't know me, I go by Trey. And today I will be getting my LASIK eye surgery. So I'm really excited. LASIK surgery changed her accent? Now, there's some huge drama online surrounding this girl that we see on our screen and her supposedly faking her accent. Now, as you just heard, according to her, she is from Thailand. And uh, based on the name of the YouTube channel, I guess owned by her and her boyfriend or brother. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. Ooh um excuse me thought this was a guy originally apparently it's a girl my bad for misgendering you i shouldn't have assumed it is 2024 of course so yeah according to the little bit of info that i could see so far uh this is her girlfriend on the left and this is the woman in question right here on the right who's from thailand who is supposedly faking her accent and the internet is outraged by the entire debacle first word is axe ideas oh Berber, scrubbery, screech, scrimp, scared, it's an easy one. Thank, rule, and a bonus round. Earn, 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 earn. Yo, that's crazy, yo. She just put like six or seven different accents in one video, bro. Like this is north, east, west, is south, all in one video. I mean, she really just said all. Like she came straight out of Alabama or the deepest, darkest southern parts of Georgia. I mean, I days old. Berber, Yo, why does she say strawberry like that? Strawberry, screech, like bitch, you are not from Atlanta. Stop it. Shrimp, scared. It's an easy one. Thank. Notice how she says thank, right? She says think as in thank. That is definitely Southern. But then here comes the bonus round where it's supposed to be Aaron earned and iron earn. This is how she says it. Earn, 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 earn. She says earn, earn, and earn, earn. Like, bitch, that is straight up from Baltimore, Maryland. That is that is how the descendants of the people from the first 13th colonies and the Irish and all them lucky charms, look at the Irish ass motherfuckers up there and their descendants will speak. But previously, most of the words she was pronouncing was with like a Southern accent. So that's a dead giveaway. She's definitely faking her accent, but it could be because she's trying to copy pop culture, which typically tends to happen when you have somebody from a different country coming over here trying to assimilate and learn the language that they're immersed in. Right? Or the accents of the people that they typically surround themselves with. Got me some soul food. We got the fried fish with yam, mac and cheese, comb bread. She said comb bread. Oh my God. Mm, that hot sauce. Or the hot sauce on the fish. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. First of all, the food looks delicious, bussin', fire, absolutely mouth watering. And it's a dead giveaway of the ethnicities that she's being friends with or hanging around with. Gotta be some real southern folk in the mix. Some people who know about some good eating. But yeah, as you can imagine, um, a lot of people are angry about this. And to be honest, as you already know, the internet is always outraged about something. Um, am I mad about this? I, I couldn't care less about how some Somebody from a different country wants to speak or try and assimilate to our culture here in America. I mean, clearly she's like mixing up different regions and taking different dialects and the way different people speak from around the country and mixing it all into one. So the longer she's here though, the more fine-tuned and refined and more she'll learn to speak more naturally as accents do change over time depending on who you're surrounded with, who you speak to every day and what kind of media you're being indoctrinated with. But yeah, a lot of people are upset. You know, somebody even pointed out that she didn't have the accent two years ago when this was filmed um your age my age i think i look like 15 years old but i'm 24 so uh, old huh? i am 20 what you don't even know your age oh my god yeah. 22 i'm gonna be 23 in october Make, in no. months mm -mm. so about two years ago as you can see when she probably just arrived here from thailand straight off the boat you know she still had sort of a semi strong taiwanese accent if you will which is of course is normal this is expected for any immigrant coming to this country however two years later now she's discovering her own accent assimilating to the culture her accent is adjusting and things have changed and i think that's what a lot of people are mad about they want her to keep her same strict ass taiwanese accent without realizing that your accent will change over time if you're no longer speaking your native tongue and you're not speaking that specific dialect because different languages demand different types of vocal cord enunciations and ways of speaking and another wild thing is there are fellow asian people coming out and you know calling this stuff out as well you got this one girl who said this that one thai girl 
who was like, oh yeah, I grew up in Atlanta and la 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 la. Okay, I'm from Houston. I grew up in the suburbs. Sometimes I use slang here and there. But why are you talking like that? You're embarrassing us. Talk normal. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? Because I'm seeing a whole lot of bullshit. So personally, I'm not sure why she's so triggered. Like, sure, she may be faking her accent, right? And she did definitely, I believe, lie about where she grew up. I was born in Thailand. And I grew up in Georgia. She says she was born in Thailand and she then grew up in Georgia, which is definitely inaccurate as two years ago in that video we just saw. Um, your age? My age? Oh, I am 20. What? You don't even know your age? Oh my god. 22. I'm gonna be 23 in October. Make in no. months. Mm -mm. So clearly, that's not a Georgia accent. It's not an Atlanta accent. It's nowhere near being Southern. It's definitely Asian. But as for this girl right here, I mean, she does say that you're embarrassing us. I mean, I really don't know what she means by that. Is she talking about Asians in general? Because there's like over a billion Asians all over Asia, India, Mongolia, Thailand, China, Malaysia, like so many Asians. I, you're not the ambassador and representation of all those different ethnicities in Asia. But again, I digress. Another Asian came out. I believe he's actually from Thailand or has some Taiwanese ancestry. And this is what he had to say about this entire situation. That's crazy because so was I. I also was born in Thailand and came here as a refugee, but when I was three years old. I'm about to turn 26, so I've been here for 20 plus years. And I grew up in the hood for those 20 plus years. And majority of my friends are black. So if anybody out there has a claim to the throne of fake accents, it's me. Because that just seems like the go-to story for everybody who's like being called out on their accent. They always say the same thing. But I feel like in order to have an accent, right, to truly speak the way you claim to speak, I feel like you need to be fully immersed right in an environment by people who all sound like that like when you're young and you're learning english and you're impressionable right you need to be learning english from people who talk like that who have been talking like that their whole lives and like i don't really see any other uh way to develop an, a genuine accent like outside those reasons you know what i mean and guess what miss conebred i am the same ethnicity as you we are a part of the same community and i know a lot of the same people you know i've checked your socials we have a bunch of mutuals and the community is saying as we all know by now that you don't talk like that for real and i don't know why you're on this app trying to convince million of people on the internet that you do talk like that because i'm not really seeing what the end goal is like what are you trying to gain from out of this you know what i'm saying what are you trying to uh, get by faking an accent and claiming to speak a certain way like there's nothing wrong with being yourself in fact your immigrant accent is actually pretty cool so i don't know why you would just keep your original accent and not you know try to claim another one it's okay to be yourself. No one's going to shame you for being yourself. There's nothing wrong with being yourself. And you fucking making us look bad, bro. And I'm tired. So, yeah, I agree with most of what he says. It is the go-to excuse. You were born there, but you grew up here when you obviously did not. And you definitely got to immerse yourself in a specific culture or around a certain group of people in order to adopt the language or the accent in a way that doesn't throw people off, right? And you definitely shouldn't be lying about your origins. However, my brother, I don't necessarily think she's faking anything in the way that we think fake means i think it's just a natural progression in the changing of one's accent over time that's natural that's perfectly natural even as an adult you still have a lot of neuroplasticity in your brain that allows you to learn certain things adjust to certain environments and ways of thinking that being said though let me know your thoughts and opinions down below i really for me it's not that deep but i know to a lot of you probably you feel some type of way because you know the world is soft people are offended fake outrage and she she said cornbread as cone bread she pronounced pronounces think as thank like a southern person would but then pronounces Aaron earned and iron earn as earn earn and earn earn like a northern person would so the inconsistencies are throwing the community off that being said though hope you guys enjoyed and new video tomorrow